come through turns three and four, and as the green flag waves, it's time to cowboy up. Everybody gets away cleanly here, Pat, and it's nearly a drag race out of turn two. C.J. Leary able to edge out in front, but it's Tanner Thorson going to work on the inside of Paul Neenizer, forcing up to second. Yeah, Tanner Thorson shows his serious. Jake swats behind him, now Jake goes to the outside. Good side-by-side -side action right here as we work lap number two. C.J. Leary's loving it. Tanner Thorson tries to pull the same move he did on Neenheiser over in three and four. Neenheiser tries to gather him back up and get going. He's not able to. Here comes Justin Grant, car number four, up to position number four. He'll set his sights on Neenheiser. Down the back straightaway. Grant door-to-door -door with Neenheiser. Kevin Thomas Jr. working hard on that Dr. Pepper number nine as well. Working the outside, or he's the inside, excuse me. Dr. Pepper number nine looks like it's fast tonight. Him in, but just as Grant bobbles off a of turn number two, that allows Kevin Thomas Jr., who has just been chugging along down on the inside, to continue to try to horn his way in. This is good stuff as they've reeled in lap traffic here. Grant trying to go high. Thorson moves down to the bottom to cover KTJ. It's about to get three wide here for second. And Kevin Thomas went even lower. Got underneath Thorson. will try to dive him off right there. But at the line, it's KTJ. Crossed flags in this one. 15 down, 15 to go there. We've seen him have a big, strung out lead right after the start of this one. The green flag has flown. We've been green for 20 laps. But CJ Leary now has Kevin Thomas Jr. I'd call it about 10 car lengths, maybe a little bit less behind him. And this is just really impressive considering the amount of traffic. And KTJ and Grant are still reeling Leary in. Yeah, and here is Leary. You see, we look at him. He'll get a little bit of traffic. There's the battles behind, as documented right there on your screen. Kevin Thomas Jr. trying to move forward and also hold that position. Inside of 10 laps to go now, they'll see seven laps and C.J. Leary gets back to the start-finish line. The race leader working the high side through three and four. Justin Grant, Kevin Thomas Jr. not giving it up, not yet. Justin Grant gets around KTJ. He's into second, but for how long? KTJ still looks good on the bottom. Boy, that needs to pick his spot if he's going to try and make something happen. Yeah, he may have one shot and one shot only. That's Cole Bodine in front of your leaders, and Grant is right there. He can smell this one. He's won here before. They've done lots of work to Plymouth Speedway since the series was here one year ago. The racing has improved greatly. A multi-lane racetrack has developed. White flag waving at the starter stand. We're going to see what they've got here. Grant trying to reel in Leary as they come down the back straightaway. Leary's just got to hit his marks, and he should get it done. And C.J. Leary, who woke up in the middle of the night thinking about the Plymouth Raceway dirt, he thought right, and he gets in a victory lane.